I'm waiting to get to my place. Lucio Vialpando, or Chief, as his friends call him, is looking forward to living in his newly remodeled unit at Cofelt Lamoro, the place he's called home for 48 years. I'm already 90 years old, man. That's a lot of years. I didn't think I'd last this long, to be frank with you. He's been here during some of the public housing project's worst years. It was rough. It was rough. Pretty rough. Everybody, you know, a lot of fights and arguments. And a lot of people struggling, you know, trying to get by. He's now here for the transformation. It's quite a difference. <laughs> quite a difference. They're not awful nice now. The affordable housing complex, built in the 50s, was slated for demolition just a few years ago. It would have been a disaster not only to 300 families, but a neighborhood school, Hamilton School. Uh, we were able to work with, with other public entities and private partners to be able to preserve this. And we were able to put $49 million to redevelop this beautiful community. A lot of the upgrades had to be with the infrastructure, the sewer, all the electrical, all the plumbing, all the lines. Every unit was gutted. Created all new streets, interior streets. The playgrounds are new, the whole park is new. A favorite for the kids. And for the whole family, there's a clinic, learning center, workforce development, and park services on site. Since the county has helped, you know, to approve the complex here, I really hope that we, as the residents and the people here, will really see the the better outlook that we could have a better future, a better life. For Maricopa County News, I think, you know, it's much better now. I'm Erica Flores.